If you work for ASML customer support, every day you have to travel an average of 10,000 kilometers to customers and see if their machines are working as they're supposed to. This is Luke Peters. He works in one of the three control centers worldwide. In one day, he can check a machine in Seoul at 9, do a support job an hour later in Tokyo, and fix a problem in Santa Clara, California over lunch. Yet, he never leaves his office. I uh, travel uh, virtually. The machines at our customer sites are all overviewed here in this control center. Um, from my desk I can uh, check every system in, in detail. Of course I don't do this alone. I do this with my colleagues here in Veldhoven, uh, Taiwan and in the US. And in that way we can deliver 24-7 uh, support worldwide. ASML machines operate 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. Yet they're some of the most complicated machines you can find in the world. These machines challenge the laws of physics. The tiniest aberration, causing chip features to move by just a few atoms, can render a chip useless. Such machines, which can cost more than 30 million euros each, obviously require very good care. Every customer, therefore, is assisted by ASML engineers nearby. However, the machines are of such immense complexity that it's impossible to have a service specialist for every detail. ASML has three remote maintenance support centers around the world, where true specialists monitor every detail of the machine and fix problems directly in the field. Every day we see examples of the value that these specialists contribute. Uh, the local team was not able to find a problem, therefore we locked in remotely and within 30 minutes we were able to fix the problem and bring it back to production. At ASML customer support on a day-to-day -day basis, hundreds of machines are under supervision at over 35 customer locations worldwide. Thanks to this, the speed and accuracy of our machines is improved at distance. This new customer support system helps customers save money by more production time. And there's more. It's not only maintenance. ASML also collects a lot of data from systems around the world and that way creates a database that can predict maintenance jobs proactively. And before a problem becomes a problem, it's already fixed. With a customer in Taiwan, I noticed some slightly uh, changes during production of advanced uh, chips. Uh, for me, that was an indication that uh, there was probably some contamination in the system and that could result in bad uh, chips. Therefore, I uh, proposed a cleaning action during uh, scheduled maintenance uh, and that resulted in a good production without any interruption. Fixing and preventing problems is the core of any customer service organization. But the customer service organization at ASML also has an opportunity to really add value by suggesting improvements to the chip production systems. Tim Chen and his team of customer support engineers work at the ASML Center of Excellence in Lingkou in Taiwan. They provide the latest way of working to ensure that ASML systems are running at optimal production performance, which means producing as many good ships as possible. Based on the analysis, the team provides recommendations to customers. The objective of providing this type of uh, consultancy services to our customer is to enable them to squeeze every bit in performance and productivity out of our machine whenever possible at 5 to 20 percent higher performance in overlay imaging and productivity in lithography can mean a difference of millions of dollars for our customers in their chip making. Luke and Tim may not share the same office but they certainly share one and the same goal to keep those lights on green day in day out for a long time to come. When Luke and Tim travel home they know that colleagues around the world are watching the traffic.